Interested in starting a brand? Maybe you already have a business, but you want people to connect with your company. My name is Fernando, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to build a brand for a business. Whether you have your business up and running, or you want to launch it, brand is what's gonna separate you from competition. For more videos about tea, business, and making a profit, check out Zen's YouTube channel or Zen's corporate website at zensteahouse.com. Branding is not as simple as a logo, right colors, or a catchphrase. It's more than a motto. Zen's Tea House is helping people through the power of tea. This model wasn't developed simply from an idea that I wanted to project. Brands, like people, has to be authentic. A brand that is not sincere, a brand that is not genuinely true to itself will be found out by people, competition, probably most importantly, to the people in your own company. I'm gonna share with you in light detail because we could spend a lot of time on this, but I care about your time and I wanna get straight to the point. When it comes to building a brand, it's all built around one person, the owner, the CEO, the head, the manager. That one person will make or break that brand for better or for worse. I like to eat vegetables. I'm primarily a vegetarian, but I eat meat. If I was gonna start a business that was only vegetarian, vegan, let's just say that, it would not work because me as a person enjoy meat. If you have a brand that's into athletics, if you have a brand that's into having fun, it's customer coming for a brand. Hello, this is Fernando with NC, so I'm gonna help you. Sure, for two T's? Two Roy Boys teas iced. Any honey or agave? With honey. Okay, well, you got it. All right, sit, Hang on. bye. Are we still recording? All right. I like tea, I like people. Customers call and they could hear the genuineness of me promoting a, a brand that I believe in. I want you to understand that when it comes to your business, you have to be sincere and genuine. Business is not easy. You don't want to do yourself a disservice by pretending to be someone you're not. People love authenticity. This is why some people, whether you like them or not, you connect with them because you know who they are. People would rather do business with someone they know and don't like than someone they don't know at all. People would rather vote, support, or endorse someone they don't like, but they know because they're genuine. In business and in life, not everyone's gonna connect with you or your brand. Why is that? Because no one person connects well with everyone. You wanna connect with the right people and your brand will separate itself from other similar products or services if you are genuine and talking to the perfect ideal customer. And that's somehow somewhere a one or two degree away from you, or it might be exactly the type of person you are. When it comes to building a brand, understand that it has to be genuine, it has to be sincere. If you are trying to be something you're not, it won't work. This is why a lot of people would rather stay away from a brand because they don't like people, they don't like talking um, with angry customers, they don't actually believe in the product or service they're selling or promoting. That's reality. Those are what I call money chasers. They chase the money. If you wanna be successful in business, if you wanna be successful with your brand, don't chase the money. Chase the concept. Run after the idea. You fall in love with someone first before you want to spend your whole life with them. You fall in love with the business before you become a lifetime customer. Hope you found this useful. I hope you enjoy this uh, concept. And if you have any questions about building a brand, take a look at the book, The Brand Gap. If you want one-on-one -on -one attention on how to build your brand, whether it's tea or not, specialize in tea, email me, Fernando at Zen's Tea. Dot com. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comment below.